My name is Taylor Lidekainen, and I'm a follower of Jesus Christ. Today, as I'm baptized, I'd like to thank my sister, Sarah. If it weren't for the transformation that God performed through her salvation, I wouldn't have seen God's redeeming power so vividly, something so beautiful and miraculous that only God could be responsible. Jesus has made the biggest difference in my life through opening my eyes. Only when Christ claimed me for his own did I realize that the entire purpose of my life was glorifying the one who gave that life to me. A Bible verse that means a lot to me is Psalm 68, 5. Father to the fatherless is God in his habitation. And that's because when my father abandoned our family, I felt like there were so many holes left in my heart because I really loved him and wondered how he could leave us. I was heartbroken. I thought no one would ever be able to love me the way my father did, but it turns out God is my father, and he loves eternally. And I can hold on to the promise that God made to Joshua, and he makes to me when he said, never will I leave you, never will I forsake you. I'd like to ask my family and friends to pray that I will continue to serve Christ with a fiery passion until the day I die, because that's really all that matters. My name is Morgan Pulley, and I'm a follower of Jesus Christ. Today, I am baptized. I'd like to thank my mom, my dad, and all my group leaders at Northridge. Jesus has made the biggest difference in my life in the falling away, leading me to do the right thing, even though it's not the easiest to do, to believe that he died on the cross for my sins, and even though I'm not perfect, he forgives me. I would like to ask my friends and family to pray that I can help others believe that Jesus died for us and to always do the right thing, and to stay with God throughout my whole life. Uh, my name is Brian Joyce, and I am a follower of Jesus Christ. Today, as I am baptized, I would like to thank my oldest brother, Chuck, who uh, really was instrumental in leading me. Jesus has taught me to be uh, compassionate with people and not to be a judge. A Bible verse that means a lot to me is Romans 3.23, for all have sinned and fallen short of the glory of God. The things that I've done in the past, whether I thought I was a good person or not, the one thing that was, uh, was, was real to me is finally realizing that I was a sinner and that it takes Jesus to change your life and you can only be saved through him. I would ask my friends and family to pray that, that I continue down this journey. Um, there's always bumps in the road and there's always struggles that we have, but I pray that uh, I can be an example for somebody else and help lead them uh, to a better life. My name is Anthony Roy and I am a follower of Jesus Christ. God has used many people in my life to point me to Jesus. Today as I am baptized I would like to thank the many people that have undoubtedly prayed countless hours for me including my wife who I love endlessly and in no order my grandparents Tom Murray, Scott Heil, Big D, Mama C, Mom and Dad, Jim and Charla, Jason Fritz, and Michael Burns. Jesus has made the biggest difference in my life in the following ways. Teaching me how to live correctly, discipling me when needed, and providing endless grace. A Bible verse that means a lot to me is Colossians 3. And the reason is because it challenges me to be the best man I can be through a focus on God and those things he sees as good. I would ask my friends and family to pray that I am able to serve them as well as others as Jesus instructed and to live the life he would have me lead. My name is Aaron Hayes and I am a follower of Jesus Christ. Today as I am baptized I would like to thank my parents for all the love they have given me and how they have always taught me about God. I would also like to thank the rest of my family for being supportive in my life and helping point me to Christ. Jesus has made the biggest difference in my life. He has helped me get through many difficult obstacles in my life. I have also been blessed tremendously. A Bible verse that means a lot to me is John 10.10. 10. The thief comes only to steal and kill and destroy. I have come so that they may have life and have it to the full. Jesus is the one who gave us life. Nothing we can do on our own. It is by faith and not works. My name is Bridget Esheim, and I am a follower of Jesus Christ. Today, as I am baptized, I would like to thank my parents, who were instrumental in creating the foundation of my faith. I am so grateful that they never gave up on me. I thank my husband, Sean, and my two beautiful girls, Kaylee and Kaya. Thank you to all my dear friends who encourage and inspire me. Most importantly, I thank my Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, for saving me. I was once lost, but he found me. And he filled the deep, empty hole that was in my heart. 
I love the promise God gives us in Philippians 4.13, where it says, I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. The Lord doesn't just say he will help us with some things in life, but through this verse, he reminds us he is there in all things, guiding us through every circumstance we encounter. I would ask my friends and family to pray that I continue to deepen my walk with the Lord. May I be a light that shines for Jesus each and every day that he blessed me with on this earth so that I might point others towards him, our one true ultimate hope.